Welcome back. It is rumba time. I'm Matt. I'm Maggie. And we're gonna do fifth and spiral today. Now we uh if you want to rewatch any of this stuff, you can check out the time codes below. We got the demo, we got the lead, the follow, the breakdown, the key points, all of that good stuff down there below. So feel free to check it out and hop into those. But hey, let's go ahead and jump into the pattern demonstration. Let's go. All right, let's go ahead and demonstrate this pattern for the very first time. We're gonna do this from a follower's beginning perspective. We start off in the closed position. We're gonna go slow, quick, quick, slow. 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 All right, let's go ahead and do this from the leader's beginning first back there. We'll start off in a closed position. And we have slow. Quick, quick, 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 slow. All right, let's break this pattern down. So we have an inside turn into an opening out. We do a fifth position. Then we step out of it going into a spiral. We do some sways, fifth position, spiral, sways. That's our order. Let's kind of slowly mark through this. So we would have basic for the beginning of a box for slow. We do an inside left turn for quick, quick. Leader grabs the follower's left hand. So we go side for slow. We open to our fifth position break, going back for quick, quick. Now that we don't turn and face one another, we step forward over that outside foot to begin the spiral. Leader uses that inside hand to bring the hand through to begin the spiral for slow O. We step out for forward for quick, reconnect and face each other for quick, and then we sway for slow. Quick, quick, slow. Now we open for our fifth on the other side. Quick. Quick, walk forward for the slow. On the second count of that slow, we spiral. There's the O. Step forward for quick. Forward and side for quick, we connect. Slow. And then we have quick, quick, slow. Open down. All right, leaders, let's go ahead and get into our footwork. So we start off top of a box. We have slow, inside left turn. Side close for quick, quick, grab the follow's hand, slow, start the rotation. Fifth position, quick, quick, lead forward, slow, oh. Step back forward for quick, side, quick, reconnect the hand, back, Ooh, slow, quick, quick, slow. Now we go into our fifth, quick, quick. Forward for our spiral, slow, up, step out, quick, quick, again, sway, slow, finish your swing action, quick, quick, slow, you're done. One more time, top of your box, slow, inside left turn, quick, quick, grab the follow's hand, slow, open for your fifth, quick, quick, spiral, slow, step out, quick, Quick, slow. Now do your sways. Quick, quick, slow. Your fifth. Quick, quick. Step forward, don't face the partner. Slow. Now come out quick, side, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. All right, fellas, here's our footwork. So, in our closed position, we're going back on our right, and then we have this inside left turn for quick, quick, and then slow. We would normally open out and style out, but our lead is going to grab our hand at that point and lead us into a fifth position for quick, quick, and then we'll step forward and spiral for slow. And then we step out of 
it for quick, so the side quick, and then we have our sway. So we slow, and then quick, quick, slow. Now that our weight is over our right foot, now we're going to do another fifth position for quick, quick. So our weight back on our left, forward on our right, then we step forward onto our left, and we spiral over it for slow. Again, step out of it, quick, to the side, quick. And then we have slow, quick, quick. So this second quick, our weight is over our right foot. And then we transfer our weight to our left foot for slow, as if you know, we had just opened out or whatever. And we're ready for our next pattern. Key points, get your key points here. Let's go ahead and go over this pattern for this. So, a uh, couple of things. So we have our inside turn that sets us up going into the fifth. So sometimes the fifth can be misdirected. So we want to create momentum going in this direction after this turn. So I guess if we go ahead and do we turn, we connect. I don't want to stunt the followers' uh, momentum that way because if I step dead still for the slow, then it's going to be hard to suddenly pivot over this foot or swivel over this foot to achieve that fifth position. It's doable, but it's not very nice. So the reason why we set this up with that inside turn is that we create the momentum, grab the hand, but don't stop them. That way you can shape into that fifth. So it's comfortably using that momentum. That's the first key point. The second one is the spirals. So we want the spiral to be led. Let's see here. Make sure I'm on the same line for us. So when we're doing our fifth, we go to the spiral. Quick, quick. A, leads, do not face your partner. Step forward on the slow. That way you get their weight over the foot, and then when you rotate, you're going to get that desired action out of it. So that's what's most important, I would say, is keep it moving forward. So over here, quick, slow. Stay tall in the chest, head up, look forward, and walk out of the forward and side. Um, some people will aim for a little touch of momentum here. So quick, slow, as long as you drag the inside of the outside of that toe while you spiral, you should kind of be able to maintain your connection to forward and keep that forward action. Just don't rise up. Go ahead and stay nice and um, low for that spiral. You don't want to change your, your height just because you're doing a turn, right? So forward action leading into the spiral, that's huge. Uh, other than that, just remember when you are in the pattern after you come out, your next slow is immediately back in towards that slot for that first slow. And then you finish your quick, quick, slow. And then we do the whole pattern all over again. Fifth, spiral, sway. So it's just repeating the action twice. Those are the key points though, that's, that's pretty much to it. If you keep the spiral led on a forward action, you'll be fine. If you don't kill the action for the fifth, you'll be fine. That's pretty much all we're talking about here. Those are my key points. All right, let's go ahead and do this in real time fashion so you can get a sense of how this would look uh, whenever you're dancing it. We'll do it a couple times just so you get a good feel for it. Let's go ahead and start closed position. We have slow, quick, quick, 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 slow. All right, that is us for today. Great job, everyone. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. Uh, check us out at dailydanceservices.com on social media. Send us an email, a text, and all that good stuff. We'll be more than happy to get to you. So uh, we will see you next time.